Hello, dear students of grade 4. You are welcome to unit 13. Hobbies and interests. So, hobbies are the activities that we love doing in our free time. Our free time, our free time, we have a lot of time. We have a lot of time. Okay? Some people like okay, music, listening to music, some people like watching TV, some people like okay, reading, etc. So, Look at the pictures and so this is what these people might like doing. In the first picture, you can see a girl, she is reading a story. Uh, okay, now she has a story book. So we can see she loves reading stories. Uh, stories, yes, you are right. Yes, she loves reading stories. Okay, stories, yeah, in this way. And the uh, second picture, you can see a man, he is taking photos. So he likes taking photos. His hobby is taking photos. In the third picture you can see a man running he likes running in the third, fourth picture you can see uh, he likes cycling now listen and sing it's exciting to have a hobby hobbies are lots of fun. you can take photos or build model planes there are hobbies for everyone everyone go hobby you know hobby kurao interesting hobby ma so okay some people uh, would draw or paint with us who was stars at night. I'm not no obvious. I was drawing on it because I'm painting on it because I'm starting at Marathi. I'm starting to do it. You can make jewelry or it's your clothes because you can do jewelry. Now, or even make your own kite. My kite, when I'm now, I'm not going to look at the person uh, boy making kite. It is such a fun to have a hobby. Hobby on a mile. And I'm now, so that is perfect one for you. Try some interesting new ones. This can apply on a bunny. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Um, and you will love your hobby too now having a hobby it's uh, exciting you can uh, this word is in the name exciting having hobbies exciting hobbies are for everyone some people watch stars at night the poem suggests us to try some interesting or interesting new hobbies now Look at the picture. You can see students reading in the library, school library. What do you think the people are doing in the picture? They are reading a book. They are reading books in library. Okay, next one. Why do you think they are doing that? Because they are uh, reading is their hobby. Reading is their hobby. So now hobbies and interests. Mary has a lot of hobbies and interests. Mary got the hobbies or It's she usually gets up early behind a so she can run before walk. I'm going to the pala on the Dorina, Sakun, sit to the Amor on the pala Dorina, some of us when you sit to Ursin Bianama. She doesn't often have time to ski, Unugo, Ovi, when you go ski or new, Tara Unisanga, Ovi Gana, some of my Hundaina, Ski Gana, some of my Hundaina, Yuma, Skiminusina, just Skimins enjoying, enjoying in the snow. You might see pretty clearly, but see occasionally. See occasionally, okay. Goes on Saturdays during the winter. You enter the winter. Winter, okay. Mary often rides a horse at a stable. I'm going to interest when you go away when you go stable. Ma, go to the stable once at the end of the winter. Though, what else on the minimum in the garden is stable, sir. The only go to so no, riding horse is also hobby. She so sometimes she goes after walk, but she usually goes horseback riding on Sundays. There are only Sunday my junction. She loves music, music on Lamona Parsa. She always goes to the temple on Wednesday evening. Wednesday evening go on Sunday temple junction. Monday must she doesn't have much extra money. She must put some of the next time when you see. So she rarely goes to concert in the city. This can only see a concert. Bibina Sangiti, Karekara Muru, Sangit Git concert or Mauni Zandin and Cassi Zandin, Birale Jansen, Kaja Jansen. She seldom watches TV, there only watch TV at Nurgo Vichina, she Kaila Gami comments in TV only, but I heard dinner because she likes doing things outside on the TV at Numan, Napani, by the way, or Kamur Ganaman Porsa. She usually goes to gym if it is running outside. I know, Pani Ago Sone, Mary. Gym, my dancing gym, my physical fitness, like gym dancing, Eddie Pani also any not only running girls in walking girls in walking or running in the morning is her hobby. Okay, she is not often alone because she has a lot of friends. Only a click wrong in an only price at the song on sinking that there is at your son. She occasionally does something alone. Lay then a key, a clay, many cake and person. 
but she usually does her activity with one of her friends. Pray, only Sati Sangi Gods in Winkia Kalabu, you know. Only the me equally classy camboy, equally busted, and she's a happy woman, only the pussy Suki Moylason. Now, why does Mary usually get up early? So the correct answer is she gets up early to run before walk. She gets up early to run before walk. Now, second, how often does she sky? She occasionally sky in winter. So she occasionally skis winter, uh, occasionally money go, you know, sometimes okay. And next one, mm, when does she usually go horseback riding? She usually goes horseback riding on Sundays. How often does she go to concert in the cities? Rarely, the main bit of lay, you know, come somewhere, rarely when you go, never just stay. How often does she watch TV? She seldom watches TV. TV ni unle khasi er dinan. What does she usually do if it's raining? She goes to the gym if it's raining. So me at least at least five activities you do in your free time. You can write. I love listening to music. I love playing football. I love watching movies. I love visiting new places. I like visiting. New, you can write uh, any activities you do. Pronounce the words, notice the sounds, the letters in the mark. Ski, see, achieve, see, dream, winter, list, think, steal, see shop. Now, complete these sentences. Use the words from the reading text above. She doesn't often have time to ski. Doesn't often have. She doesn't have much time. Now she uh, she is not often alone. Now answer honestly about yourself. Choose from the bracket so you can uh, write if you like. Uh, for me, I don't like coffee. My sister uh, doesn't watch television. My parents uh, live together. Uh, we we work in the field. Our teachers uh, give us a lot of homework. Uh, I went to school yesterday, so you can write uh, whatever is suitable for you, these students. Now, okay, look at this next exercise. Change the following sentences into negative sentences. So, in negative, you know, these students, I have given you some basic rules. If the verb is verb 5, if the verb is simple present tense, verb 5, we should use does not plus verb 1. If the verb is verb 2, if the verb is simple past tense, verb 2, we should use didn't plus verb 1. If the verb is verb 1, if there is verb 1, we should use don't plus verb 1. So look at the example, they talk a lot. Talk when you do, yeah, verb 1, so they don't talk a lot. Now, hey, he tells a lie, he doesn't tell a lie. Tells means verb 5, so he doesn't tell. Hey. They speak tamang fluently, they don't speak tamang fluently, don't speak. C. They talk to one another. They don't talk to one another. D. She earned a lot of money last month. She didn't earn a lot of money last month. She didn't earn a lot of money last month. E. Sunita has two brothers. Sunita doesn't have two brothers. Nitesh did his homework. Nitesh didn't, didn't do his homework. Subhan watches TV in the morning. Subhan doesn't watch TV in the morning. Next one. My mother gets up early. My mother doesn't get up early. Nero give, um, gave me a beautiful notebook. Nero didn't give me a beautiful notebook. Who are these people? What are they? What are they doing? Okay, now, this is listening to students. Now, uh, next one is uh, reading second. So, you can, what do the what do the ball like doing? The ball uh, uh, likes flying in the sky. What do the boy like doing? The boy likes uh, reading a uh, storybook and just uh, oh, no? uh, watching the boards. What do you like doing? I like playing in the okay, uh, park. So, dear students, uh, learn these words from any complete. Okay, now you can do it. It's very easy. Rina was born to a typical Nepali family. Write down typical. Okay, here. Rina was born to a typical Nepali family. Saturday is the weekend. Saturday is the weekend here. Weekend in Nepal. Saturday is the, is the weekend in Nepal. There is a quiz competition. It's a very easy quiz competition. 
and the we want one uh trip when a trip the image of currency in the uk is pound okay pound uk is called uh, the currency in uk is called pound now true or false megan usually does her homework in the evening this is true megan likes listening to music false the young safe for Britain competition is only for British young people too. Okay, next D. The competitors have to cook a meal for a family. False. Each competitor can spend 15 pounds or more. True. The fries. Uh, okay, this is false. Okay, not true. Each competitor can spend 15 pounds. So this is uh, only 15 pounds, not more. This is false. This is false, dear students. And uh, this is false statement okay this is false okay next one the prize is to learn more about italian cooking in fruit and this is also false it is a uh, okay next one what does megan like doing in her free time she likes cooking in her free time she likes cooking she likes walking okay she has so many hobbies how much money can she can the chefs spend on food the chefs can spend 50 pounds on food the chef can spend maximum 50 pounds. What is Megan doing now? Megan is practicing for the competition in the kitchen. What main meal is Megan preparing? Megan is preparing paella, a Spanish rice dish. Megan is preparing paella, a Spanish rice dish. Now, next one, grammar. So here, yeah, this is also um, Expressing hobbies, it's a lag of hobby or back to the or not like a way. It's hobby by hobby, very another don't. If you like to do something, you should use love or like. If you don't like, you should use hate. So, the old lady loves working. Okay, the old lady hates. She doesn't you know, old lady never likes. Okay, old lady like the hairs, like you know, okay, hairs, write down hairs. Yes, it yes, yes. Old lady lay in the socket and long is so write down. Old lady, yes. And the boy likes watching to cartoons. Uh, students like reading English. Did the old man late working a lot? Ali likes asking others for their money. She likes going every Saturday. Manu loves visiting doctors. Krishna loves curing flowers in the garden. So, this is also about it. Uh, I don't like playing marbles. I like washing clothes. I like getting up early in the morning. I like singing English songs. I don't like being alone. I hate doing a lot of poor homework. I like taking up bath. Next, and look at the pictures and below. So, what are they uh, they like doing? So, she likes giving a speech. She likes singing or she likes speaking in the public. She likes speaking in the public. They like reading and writing. They like writing. Reading and writing. And he likes dancing. Now, we can make a sentence uh, from here. Uh, look at the example. She likes talking on the phone. My sister doesn't like dancing. I love reading comics. Ellen hates telling lies. My friend likes playing football. Pasang doesn't like painting. Fussy hairs going shopping. Anjali likes grazing cattle. Mingma loves listening to world songs. Sanket hairs peeping tea. Batuk loves going shopping. Nitish likes dancing. Okay, here singing. Mon loves listening to music. Nisa is working hard. Sila likes singing. Now it's very important, dear students. Comes to the following. So here, hi, yes, it's capital, and after that, exclamation sign. <laughs> hi, yes, capital, and exclamation sign, exclamation sign. Everyone, I, I is capital, I have a sister, Pulista, or as capital, our name is Sindhu, yes, capital, Pulista, then, then yes, capital, she is six years old, and Pulista, and C capital, likes eating ice cream, but she doesn't like eating pizza. C capital loves to watch. Uh, she loves to watch TV. T capital V capital or hard than uh, S capital. List of there and our favorite programs are Motu Patlu, 
comma, Mina and Logdori, Blister, C Capital, has reading books but enjoys listening to stories. And here, Blister, do you have a brother or sister that is similar? Question mark. Now it's very easy. My hobby is drawing. I almost uh, I mostly draw pictures of people, animals, and birds. I use crayons, pencil. Okay, it's very easy. This one is about uh, hobby. So you can write the hobbies of your grandmother, grandfather, grandness, this story, etc. So dear student, thank you for watching. Uh, it's all about exercise unit thirteen. Uh, next day, I will come up with the solutions with the guide to unit 14. Thank you very much.